Hello, welcome to Horror of Spice, where everything's nice. I'm Vince Spice. And I'm Becky Spice. And this is Sleazy Hump Day, where <laughs> we get to with you and get over this hump day with a little sleaze. Uh, our movie selection is The Hunchback of the Morgue, mm -hmm. a Paul Nachi film. And new for the channel, we're also going to review a marijuana strain. This one is Motorhead. It is a hybrid, and the company is True Fusion. Mm -hmm. This is an eighth, which means it's uh, 3.5 uh, grams. Obviously, we're not going to smoke 3.5 grams, but <laughs> we're going to try it out. Because I believe in the three B's. Blood, boobs, and bud. So, uh, catch us in a second. And uh, we'll review Motorhead. And the Hunchback of the Morgue. <laughs> Stay tuned. Welcome back, everybody. Well, uh, the Hunchback of the Morgue with Paul... Nishi and uh, Rosanna Yanni, The Hunchback of the Morgue, 1973, a.k.a. The Rue Morgue Massacres. Paul Nishi and Rosanna Yanni, Maria Percy, and Vic Winter. This Nashi stars as Gotho, a moronic hunchback, excuse me, who works in the morgue. When the love of his life dies, he kills the med students who try to dissect her corpse and hides her in the underground vault. A mad doctor promises to restore her life in exchange for a supply of dead bodies. One amazing scene shot without any special effects has Nushi fighting off an army of rats with the torch which actually caused him to receive many painful bites. It's rated R. It's 90 minutes long. And uh, this was made by Is Film. You can catch them at www.isfilm.net. There's the disc. There's the back. Now, Motorhead. Uh. This was a gold tier at Curaleaf here in town. Mm -hmm. um, Curaleaf breaks it down in silver. Uh, well, there's shake, then there's silver, then uh, gold, then platinum, then platinum plus. Uh, this is about $150 for an ounce. Um, What would you say the smell, initial smell is? You know, I get almost like an even mixture between citrus and diesel. And it's not bad. I know it sounds like a weird combination, but it really works. It meshes well. It's like you, you inhale it and you're just like, oh, wow. And it just, the combination just just smells so fresh and alive. It's a, it's a great combination. Um... The Hunchback of the Morgue, quite profusely, uh, a great film. I was never uh, bored watching it. Uh, everything was always interesting. There was always something going on. Um, most of the scenes actually take place in the morgue, uh, in the underground setting, really. Um, the uh, moronic... Hunchback makes a friend uh, out of a female after his love of his life dies. And uh, uh, they even make love to, with each other in the film. Uh, it's a nice touch to see somebody, you know, with an extreme deformity uh, still treated like a human being in one of these films. Um... I recommend Motorhead with this because you want to be entertained through and through. You don't want to think about how your back's hurting. You don't want to think about 
how uh, your your uh, knees and hips and all that stuff is hurting. So uh, take a few little hits off of that while you watch the movie and just sit back and relax. Remember, the hump day doesn't have to be a bad thing. It could be a good thing. It could be a, a moment where we all get together and watch something sleazy. <laughs> well, from Horror of Spice. And this is Horror of Spice. Y'all stay creepy now. Bye. Bye.